All right, I'm at Chuck E. and Cheese right now. Just placed my order, got my number, and they had his deal. Buy $10 in tokens, get the $4 churros for free. So I had to jump on that deal. I got $10 in tokens. And it's funny, after I ordered, it's just like, we're out of the pink ones, but we have blue and green. I'm like, well, damn, you could have told me that before I ordered. I'm gonna go play some games. Everybody, Roger here. You guys saw that I'm at Chuck E. Cheese. They tricked me. They gave me this deal. So I got the unicorn churros. They're brand new today. After I order them, she's like, we're out of pink ones, but we got green and blue. I'm like, oh, okay. You can tell me that first. Anyway, she tricked me because these are four bucks for four of them. And then the deal, at least today, you spend 10 bucks on tokens and you get these for free. So I was like, six more dollars for $10 worth of tokens. I can get some tickets, have some fun while I wait. And I did just that. I got a bunch of tickets. I'm pretty surprised. I'm pretty good at ski ball. Anyways, moving on, I got them here. We got the blue and the green. The red one is either cherry or cotton candy. I heard mixed reviews on those. I'm not sure which one it is, but these ones are blue raspberry and sour green apple. Take a look, take a look. Mm. Okay, now these flavors do sound really kind of disgusting. Like kids would like them, but me, I'm not sure if I would like them. I prefer, you know, basic cinnamon churro. But we got them here, we got four of them. And the question of the day, these took forever to make, are these fresh or are they recycled? That's what's on your mind. We're gonna find out, see if they're all the same length. You guys ready for this? Okay, they're all the same length, but you know, they could have easily faked that. Hmm, conspiracy time. All right, so let's take a look at this green one here. We got sour green apple. It does have some blue on it from the other one. Mm -hmm. Decent size. So these are basically like, if you got a full size churro, it would probably be about this size, two of them. So it's basically like two churros for four bucks. Not really the best deal ever. And they do feel kind of hard. Hopefully they're good. They took a long time to make. I was playing games and I was like, well, they're still not at the table. Anyways, here we go. Let's do the first bite of the sour green apple. Ooh. Definitely tastes like a unicorn. Mmm, <laughs> you can definitely taste that sour green apple. It's really like a weird combination. Sure with sour green apple. Now, they were sitting at the table for a few minutes. I had to go wash my hands and everything. Cause you know how dirty Chuck E. Cheese is? Mm-mm. So, they're not super hot right now. So, maybe they were a little bit better when they first showed up. Oh, my God. Look at this one, though. You could get all that blue raspberry dust on there. Mm. See how this goes. The cotton candy one sounded disgusting. Cherry sounded all right. This one sounds all right. I mean, I don't know. Still not cinnamon. Mmm. These are like the sugariest things ever. And they're pretty messy. Oh, no wonder they gave me a bunch of plates. They know I was by myself. They gave me three plates for four churros. Mm -hmm. Overall, the churros, not too bad, not worth four bucks for these. But I mean, at Chuck E. Cheese, if you're there, you might as well get them. You know, give one to each kid or something. Ugh. Honestly, these flavors aren't that great. I mean, they taste like the flavor, but you know, you don't really want this flavor when it comes to a churro. Mmm. Seriously, it's kind of making me sick. And I only ate two half of them. I'm not gonna eat the other ones because they're, you know, they're the same flavor. Kind of weird you get four, but there's only three flavors, right? I mean, what do you, is the other one random? I guess you could probably pick which flavors you want, right? Cause, oh, that's probably what she did. Cause I was like, okay, that's fine. And she said they didn't have the pink ones. And she was like, okay, or whatever. And I was like, oh, I think I was supposed to tell her which ones I wanted. Ah, everyone's probably picking the cotton candy. That sounds disgusting. Mmm. Oh, I, I've tasted this before. I can't really put my finger on it. It's some kind of candy. I don't know if it's like a pix is it pixie stick? Is that what it is? I haven't had one of those in a long time. Mm. 
Look at that. Mm, unicorn dust. Woo! Kids would definitely love these. Adults, not so much. <laughs> oh, hey, there we go. I got those two left. I'm gonna just take these home and give them to some unsuspecting people. Be like, here, I got you some <laughs> unicorn. Oh, I didn't even notice the box. Look at that box. Or cup, whatever. Unicorn churros. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. I don't know about these tastes. I mean, for kids, all right, but you know. But if you guys have tried them, let me know down below what you guys thought of them. They just came out today and they're here until June 6th or something like that. And whew, it was pretty nice in there, not too busy but it's like 100 degrees out here, so I should have stayed inside and did this, but I didn't bring my tripod with me. Ugh! Anyways, though, um, four bucks, meh, but if you're already there, maybe worth it. I mean, why not? I get it with the pizza. But I probably wouldn't get these again. Too sugary tasting. Uh, cinnamon is the perfect one. These are overkill. Oh, so go try them out. Let me know what you guys think of them. Thumbs up, red subscribe button on all my channels, social media, and I'll see you in the next one.